Hey, it's Richard from Android Central with the Samsung Galaxy Alpha and the iPhone 6. This year, Apple went bigger, Samsung went a little smaller, both went metal. They produced two phones pretty closely matched, 4.7 inch devices with similar screen resolutions, although the Galaxy Alpha is thinner, slimmer, shorter, and lighter than the iPhone 6. Both have batteries around the 1800 mAh mark, although the Samsung one is removable. The difference in the footprint is in no small part due to the home buttons. Apple retained its traditional round button, which in turn lends to hefty top and bottom bezels. The Galaxy Alpha, while introducing metal to Samsung's Galaxy line, retains a plastic removable back, while the iPhone 6 is a harmony of glass and aluminium. The iPhone 6's rounded edges are nicer to hold than the straight ones on the Galaxy Alpha, but the Samsung phone is certainly less slippery to hold onto with that plastic back that has just the slightest of textures. Both phones run the latest versions of their respective operating systems, and while Apple traditionally avoids lampooning the iPhone with massive specs, both phones are fast and have the strengths of either Android or iOS's ecosystems behind them. The major difference on the hardware front is with the display. Samsung's Super AMOLED panel with its pentile matrix just doesn't offer colors as natural as those on the iPhone 6's retina display. Blacks are deeper on the Alpha, but whites have a bluish tinge and colors often look more saturated. It's a nice display for sure, but the iPhone 6 does have the edge. Both phones also pack strong camera setups. The iPhone, uh, sorry, the Galaxy Alpha has a 12 megapixel rear shooter, while the iPhone's is 8 megapixels. Both do protrude from the rear of the phone. Apple's camera app is a little simpler to use and less feature packed, but both shoot great photos in good light, while the iPhone 6 tends to have the edge when things get a little dimmer. The Galaxy S5 is the big seller in the Galaxy line, but for the average consumer going into a store and looking at a new iPhone, the Alpha is an enticing prospect. Smaller, cheaper, and perhaps even better looking, Samsung has a phone on its hands that's going to sit next to the iPhone on store shelves and look every bit as inviting.